Data centers are the backbone of our digital world. Across finance, enterprise, healthcare, education, even the apps we use on our phone, this in combination with innovations like AI and 5G are creating an explosion of demand for data center capacity. Historically, every new data center that has been built and outfitted with new equipment has negatively contributed to the world's carbon problem. Industry-generated CO2 emissions have risen by 400 million tons since 2013. Faster hardware refresh cycles create more than 50 million tons of e-waste annually. And in the extreme, it is estimated that as much as 4% of the global GHG is driven by global information and communication industry, heading to 8% by 2025. But that does not need to continue to be the case. IT Renew is fundamentally in the business of enabling a global circular economic model for the IT hardware industry. Circular economic models really look at the entire life cycle of physical assets. Everything from mining and manufacturing of materials that go into products, through use phase, energy implications and other implications, into end of life practices. If we have materials already in use, let's think about maximizing lifetime value and life cycles in the aggregate so that we can avoid all of those kind of sustainability impacts tied to new manufacturing. We can lower the cost of solutions and we can get them into where they need to be in the global markets more quickly from a, a supply chain perspective. We decommission millions of servers annually in the world's largest cloud data center environments. And we take that best in class equipment, we transform it into solutions that meet the needs of the global enterprise and other cloud service provider markets and system builders, enabling them to deliver the best, most cost effective and most sustainable solutions in their businesses. The hyperscale technology is used in the most demanding data centers worldwide. We're taking a material um, from around the world, recertifying it and transforming it back into data center technology, into edge computing technology, and that's really the core uh, of our model. We're able to provide higher density, higher performance, uh, higher reliability solutions, and that benefits our customers and their customers beyond them. By rethinking the design and the sourcing of infrastructure and infrastructure components, we're able to achieve economic efficiencies for our customers, and we're able to achieve massive environmental efficiencies as well. The financial benefit for our customers by using recertified is up to 50% cost reduction. We're able to make deliveries in two or three weeks, where others are citing two or three months, if not five and six months. If we take, as an example, 5 million servers that can be recertified and sold into secondary markets and therefore avoid the equivalent emissions tied to that new manufacturing, that's over 10 million metric tons of carbon that you can avoid. So it's the same as pulling about 2 million cars off the road annually or needing to procure about $580 million of carbon offsets. IT Renew's closed loop supply chain is the orchestration engine that maximizes the lifetime value and sustainability of IT equipment. This model enables multiple pathways for compute and storage resources that inherently minimize carbon and waste in the IT ecosystem. So when we apply the circular economy principles to the basic principles of sustainability, it does get us to zero carbon, zero waste, faster, in a more environmentally friendly, economically viable and equitable way. We are collaborating with key industry partners in defining mechanisms, frameworks, and carbon accounting pathways that would have policy level impact down the road. With World Business Council on Sustainable Development, we're working on carbon pathfinder projects to codify the concept of circular economy and circular business principles into the way carbon accounting is understood and credited for. We're working with Open Compute Project to look at the design criteria, to look at the remanufacturing criteria, product labels, metrics. How do we put these pieces together to create a particular blueprint and solution that eventually will incentivize the industries to adopt these processes? We're also working with Circular Electronic Partnerships, or CEP, and widening the lens of carbon accounting to juxtapose the principles of circular economy on the different phases of product manufacturing. What iTunu is doing will redefine the way enterprises and service providers think about aligning their hardware to their real workloads and target outcomes. 
global IT teams will shift from being supply chain burdens to their companies to being positive impact drivers on the path to net zero. IT Renew's mission is to prove that financial success is not incompatible with having a positive impact on our environment and society.